The Bible is your basic instructions before leaving earth. You may want to read the book because you're going to be gone for a long time. The first prayer I ever prayed in my life. I was about two minutes old. My mom said when I was delivered, they handed, her to, handed me to her and she counted my fingers, make sure I arrived intact, and then she folded my little hands and said, Lord, would you please supply my boy a good wife someday? Let me ask you a question. Have you ever laid your head under a semi-truck? Well, how do you know you won't like it if you don't try it? I even have a PhD in education. Stands for post hole digger. The idea that uh, evolution is true, I think, is not only silly, I think it is dangerous. You're just a piece of protoplasm that washed up on the beach. And you're not worth a thing. Well, if evolution is true, we're all going to the grave and we're going to get recycled into a worm or a plant. Guess what, Johnny? You're an animal and share a common heritage with earthworms. Uh, you mean I'm just an animal? <laughs> okay. I don't even know what kind that one is. That's a porcupine. They call that science and put it in a science book? I think I'd call that a fairy tale and put it in the garbage. Did you know they cut down a tree to print that? Where's Al Gore when you need him? Mm, that's what I want to know, yeah. If you put some fourth graders on a merry-go-round, are there any fourth graders in here this morning? Any f oh, man, all right. I like fourth graders. You probably didn't hear about this, but the kids at Columbine High School that did all the shooting were very strong believers in evolution. Here's a fourth grade textbook. Millions of years ago. Now, kids, listen. If anybody ever says, millions of years ago, just say, uh, excuse me, were you there? <laughs> Satan's a liar. Anybody that teaches evolution is in serious trouble when they stand before God. Don't want to be close to you on Judgment Day. You are in big time trouble. If evolution is true, how do we tell right from wrong? Now, we could talk for hours about that and get my CSE College Class 101 if you want a whole lot more on the New World Order plans on reducing the population. What? Wow. Have you ever been lied to before? If all I have to do is make up a story and you've got to prove it's wrong, I can keep you busy the rest of your life, can't I? But listen, kids, carefully. When I was about six years old, I was raised in East Peoria, Illinois, and I came running in for breakfast one morning, and I was the first one there for breakfast. And I got the last banana out of the bowl to put on my cereal. Well, a few minutes later, my two big brothers came in. They said, hey, Kemp, is that the last banana? I said, yep, and I got it. Is that the last banana?